Uh, a lot has to do with the, the size of our hands and holding the shoe. And what I demonstrate with my students is your hands are not strong enough to hold a shoe in place if it doesn't have clips. And so where you start the nail is very important. If you start it in the center of the nail hole and aim the, the tip of the nail forward with, without too much being excessive, and I usually do it um, more likely if I am shoeing the horse this way, I'm, I'm holding things to the, the right side of me. So I'm holding the nail you know, on the first or second nail hole when I start. That, and I'm tipping it this way forward and I'm right in the center of the hole. And the shoe will not move um, and slide sideways or backwards if you do that. If you put the nail in, in, in that is not in the center of the hole, and a lot has to do with how well you shape the shoes and how well you pick the right cross section for the foot you're nailing. If you put your nail hole like so it's wedging the shoe and you start so the shaft is pushing on the inside of, of the, the, the nail hole, it will pull the shoe either backwards or sideways and be frustrating. Now, if you have a clip on the shoe, that's, the shoe is not going to move that much if it's a properly seated clip, but you are going to be putting force on the horn tubules of the hoof wall because if that clip wasn't there, that shoe would want to slide sideways and so you really have to be good about how you line your nails up and it's a whole other skill. I would say even though the shoes are punched for eight nails, I seldom use more than six and certainly seldom never use eight in, in many cases. Mm -hmm. Quite often you have a fuller foot on the lateral outside of the, of the hoof, so maybe for security purposes and uh, uh, rough use turnout, you might put four on the outside and three on the inside because the inside of the hoof on most horses cuts around even tighter and that's a place where you can drive a what we call a close nail or, or a quicker horse. But more often than not, I'll only use six nails and the, the nailing pattern itself depends upon the hoof shape of where the nails will do the most good for the, for the foot.